Uh, we're hearing tonight that David Letterman, uh, on this topic that was so big last week, is going to make a, a, a really a lengthy apology to the Palin family on the show that is broadcast tonight. And I wanted to get your reaction to it. Let me just read a little part about this. Um, he said he saw something on TV. He saw Mark Shields about, about the joke. He said, oh boy, I'm beginning to understand what the problem is here. It's the perception rather than the intent. It doesn't make any difference what my intent was. It's the perception. Uh, I uh, take full blame for that. It was told a bad joke. I told a joke that was beyond flawed. My intent is completely meaningless compared to perception. And since it was a joke I told, I feel that they need to do the right thing here and apologize for having told that joke. Uh, I would like to apologize especially to the two daughters involved, Bristol and Willow, and also to the governor and her family and everybody else who was outraged by the joke. I'm sorry about it, and I'll try to do better in the future. After something like that is broadcast tonight, is there anything left to this stuff? I don't think there is. I think this this should be and sounds like the final word on it. And this is really David Letterman. I, I have a lot of friends of mine who've worked for him over the years. Uh, I don't know him personally, but this is my understanding of him. And I and I and I I've heard that over the weekend he did have time to think about this. He's a father himself. Mm -hmm. uh, he had some cool time to think about it. And and he could have left it where he had left it. He could have left it uh, getting laughs uh, at his original version of an apology and just leave it there. Uh, but I think both uh, as a father and a responsible guy, having had a weekend to think about this, he decided he wanted to go to this extra point of clarification of a serious apology. And the and, and you know I actually Keith in the last couple of days from a lot of professional comedy writers. I've heard more analysis of that particular mm -hmm. joke than any uh, that's ever been written. And there's a large group out there who say, hey, it was a bad joke. It had a, it had a wrong concept in it. It was a bad joke. And these are Letterman supporters and former Letterman writers, many of them. And so I think Dave reached a point that makes perfect sense. And I think he, he's making perfect sense in what he has to say tonight. Any chance, briefly, that the Palins try to outclass him and just say, accepted, Boy, uh, if there's anyone in Alaska who can who can make them, you know, handle one of these things correctly, we haven't found that person yet. So let's see what happens. That is the suspense here. If Dave Letterman does something completely reasonable like this, what is the Palin reaction? I have no ability to predict that. Oh, yes, you do. Lawrence O'Donnell <laughs> of the Huffington Post and MSNBC, and so do I, but we'll have to tune in tomorrow to find out.